In human genetics, EZ827, also known as E1B1B1B, is the name of a major Y chromosome haplogroup. It is defined as the lineage which combines the haplogroups EZ830 and EV257 and defines the common ancestry. The former is predominantly found in the Horn of Africa and the Middle East, while the latter is most frequently observed in northwestern. In Africa, it is also found at lower frequencies in Europe and in isolated parts of Southeast Africa. Subclades of EZ827 and distribution. Family tree. The following phylogeny is based on the YCC 2008 3 and subsequent published research as summarized by ISOGG. EM81 EM81 asterisk KPF2546 CPF2546 asterisk ECTS12227 EMZ11 EMZ12 EA929 EZ5009 EZ5009 asterisk EZ5013 EZ5013 asterisk EMZ16 EPF6794 EPF6794 asterisk EL351 EZ830 E1B1 B1 B2 EM123 EM34 EM84 EM136 EM290 EV23 EL791 EV1515 EV1515 asterisk EV1486 EV1486 asterisk EV2881 EV2881 asterisk EV92 EM2 293 EM 293 asterisk EP 72 EV 3065 asterisk EV 1700 EV 42 EV 1785 EV 1785 asterisk EV 6 EV257 L19 EV257 L19 showed a parallel with its sibling clade EV68 in the way that both clades show signs of having migrated from North Africa to Southern Europe across the Mediterranean Sea 6 EV257 L19 asterisk individuals were found in published samples who were EV257 L19, but not EM81, a Marrakesh Berber, a Corsican, a Sardinian, a Barana from Kenya, of Southern Spaniard and a Cantabrian. Within EM35, there are striking parallels between two haplogroups, EV68 and EV257. Both contain a lineage which has been frequently observed in North Africa and a group of undifferentiated chromosomes that are mostly found in Southern Europe. An expansion of EM35 carriers possibly from the Middle East as proposed by other authors, and split into two branches separated by the geographic barrier of the Mediterranean Sea, would explain this geographic pattern. However, the absence of EV68 asterisk and EV257 asterisk in the Middle East makes the maritime spread between Northern Africa and Southern Europe a more plausible. Hypothesis, a project dedicated to researching and understanding the origins of EV257 L19 asterisk is underway at familytridna.com. The name of the project is E1B1B1B asterisk A. EV257's dominant subclade EM81 is thought to have originated in the area of North Africa 14,200 years ago. EM81 EM81 is the most common subclade of EL19 V257 and found in the Maghreb, dominated by its subclade EM183. 
This haplogroup reaches a mean frequency of 42% in North Africa, decreasing in frequency from 100% in semi-isolated Berber populations to approximately 10% to the east of this range in Egypt. Because of its prevalence among these groups and also others such as Mozabite, Middle Atlas, Kabul and other Berber groups, it is sometimes referred to as a genetic Berber marker. Pereira A. Al. Report High Levels Among Tuareg in Two Saharan Populations 77.8% near Gorom Gorom in Burkina Faso and 81.8% from Gossi in Mali. There was a much lower frequency of 11.1% in the vicinity of Tanut in the Republic of Niger. EM81 is also quite common among North African Arabic-speaking groups. It is generally found at frequencies around 45% in coastal cities of the Maghreb. In this key area from Egypt to the Atlantic Ocean, Iredi al. report a pattern of decreasing street haplotype variation from east to west accompanied by a substantial increasing frequency. At the eastern extreme of this core range, Kujanova al found M81 in 28.6% in El Hayes in the western desert in Egypt already al. believe the pattern of distribution and variance to be consistent with the hypothesis of a post-Paleolithic demic diffusion for the east. The ancestral lineage of VM81 in the hypothesis could have been linked with the spread of Neolithic food producing technologies from the fertile crescent via the Nile. Although pastoralism rather than agriculture, EM81 and possibly Proto-Afroasiatic language may have been carried either all the way from Asia, or they may represent a local contribution to the North African Neolithic transition. According to Shomaka Keita, a Near Eastern origin of Proto-Afroasiatic speakers carrying EM81, or its ancestral lineage, is inconsistent with the linguistic evidence, which seems to indicate an African origin of Proto-Afroasiatic speakers. Keita argues that there is no autochthonous presence of the M81 in the Near East, indicating that M81 most likely emerged from its parent clade M35 either in the Maghreb, or possibly as far southeast as the Horn of Africa, Europe. In Europe, EM81 has a widespread distribution at very low frequencies but is common mostly in the Iberian Peninsula, where unlike in the rest of Europe it is more common than EM78, with an average frequency around 5%. Its frequencies are higher in the western half of the peninsula with frequencies reaching 8% in extreme Madura and South Portugal, 4% in one study and 9% in another in Galicia, 10% in western Andalusia and North Northwest Castile and 9% to 17% in Cantabria. The highest frequencies of this clade found so far in Europe were observed in the Pasiegos from Cantabria, ranging from 18% to 41%. An average frequency of 8.28% has also been reported in the Spanish Canary Islands with frequencies over 10% in the three largest islands of Tenerife, Gran Canaria and Fuerteventura. EM81 is also found in France, 2.70% overall with frequencies surpassing 5% in Auvergne and Isle de France, in Sicily, and in slightly lower frequencies in continental Italy due to historic colonization during the Islamic, Roman, and Carthaginian empires or ancient migrations in the Metals Ages through maritime means. EM81 was also found in 2013 at 5.8% in a large sample of 1,204 Sardinians.
Latin America, as a result of Spanish and Portuguese colonization of the Americas, this subclade is found throughout Latin America, for example 6.1% in Cuba, 5.4% in Brazil, and among Hispanic men from California and Hawaii 2.4%. Others, in smaller numbers, EM81 men can be found in areas in contact with the Maghreb, both around the Sahara in places like Sudan, and around the Mediterranean in places like Lebanon, Turkey, and amongst Sephardic Jews. Distribution The following gives a summary of most of the studies which specifically tested for EM81, showing where its distribution is greater than 1% in Europe, North Africa, the Middle East and Latin America. EZ830, a recently confirmed subclade of EZ827, Z830 includes the confirmed subclades VM123, EM293, and EV42, and is a sibling clade to EL19. Currently, the EM35 phylogeny project recognizes four distinct clusters of Z830 asterisk carriers, two of which are exclusively Jewish in origin. The remaining two are significantly smaller and include scattered individuals in Germany, Spain, Latin America, Egypt, and Ethiopia. EM123 EM123 is mostly known for its major subclade EM34, which dominates this clade. A new clade was defined by Trombetta et al. 2015, which originated about 12 kya in eastern Africa where it is currently mainly distributed. This clade includes all the sub-Saharan haplogroups reported as EM35 basal clades in a previous phylogeny. EM293 is a subclade of EV1515. It was identified by ISOGG as the second clade within EZ830. It was discovered before EZ830, being announced in HEN 2008 which associated it with the spread of pastoralism from Eastern Africa into Southern Africa. So far high levels have been found in specific ethnic groups in Tanzania and Southern Africa. Highest were the Datog, Khwe, Burung, and Sandor. Hen in the study also found two Bantu-speaking Kenyan males with the M293 mutation. Other EM215 subclades are rare in southern Africa. The authors state, dot dot, without information about M293 in the Maasai, Hema, and other populations in Kenya, Sudan, and Ethiopia, we cannot pinpoint the precise geographic source of M293 with greater confidence. However, the available evidence points to present a Tanzania as an early and important geographic locus of M293 evolution. They also say that M293 is only found in sub-Saharan Africa, indicating a separate phylogenetic history for M35.1 asterisk samples further north. EP72 appears in Carafe. Trombetta et al. 2011 announced that this is a subclade of EM293. Trombetta et al. 2011 announced the discovery of EV42 in two Ethiopian Jews. It was suggested that it may be restricted to the region around Ethiopia. However, further testing by commercial DNA testing companies confirmed positive results for this subclade in Arabia as well. The EV6 subclade of EV1515 is defined by V6. Cruciani al. identified significant presence of these lineages in Ethiopia, and also some in the neighboring Somali population. Among the Ethiopian and Somali samples, the highest were 14.7% among the Ethiopian Amhara and 16.7% among the Ethiopian Wulata. Trombetta et al. 2011 announced the discovery of EV92 in two Ethiopian Amhara. 
like EV6 and EV42 it possibly only exists in the area of Ethiopia. Phylogenetics Phylogenetic history prior to 2002 There were in academic literature are at least seven naming systems for the Y chromosome phylogenetic tree. This led to considerable confusion. In 2002, the major research groups came together and formed the Y chromosome consortium. They published a joint paper that created a single new tree that all agreed to use. Later, a group of citizen scientists with an interest in population genetics and genetic genealogy formed a working group to create an amateur tree aiming at being above all timely. The table below brings together all of these works at the point of the landmark 2002 YCC tree. This allows a researcher reviewing older published literature to quickly move between nomenclatures. Original Research Publications The following research teams for their publications were represented in the creation of the YCC tree.